Miss Me. In today's video is actually a bonus video that I filmed a couple weeks back just because I had so many videos that I was putting out after Burley and I never just really ended up uploading it. This is quite a vloggy vlog that a lot of you have been asking for so I hope you enjoy it. Hello everyone, I'm now at the stables. I just need to get Casper because I'm actually going to go for a hack with Scarlett which I'm very excited about because I haven't seen Scarlett for ages because she's had her A-level exams, I've had my end of year exams, then she's been away travelling in Europe so it'll be really nice to catch up and for the, both the horses to see each other. Oh, he's just come over. Hey Casp! <laughs> Hello, oh babe, you got a lot of flies. Casper is now tacked up. I've just put his boots and his saddle on. I just need to put his bridle on now and then we'll go to Scarlet's. I also have her birthday present so I need to give her that. And yeah, I will be wearing my GoPro when we're on the hack. I think we're going to the stubble field so we'll hopefully get a nice gallop there, Casp. He seems so chilled. Whenever I tack him up he literally falls asleep. I think it's because he loves being groomed. Oh, you're such a sweetie. <laughs> He'll be full of energy as soon as he sees Cookie. <laughs> Here we go again. Here we go again. Here we go again. Here loud and clear, loud and clear. Your love it draws me near, draws me near.
you guys know but I actually have guinea pigs and a lot of you have requested to see more guinea pigs in the vlogs so I'm just giving them some dinner, it's just some carrot skin, a bit of cucumber and melon. I literally didn't even call them, usually I like call them um, to come down but they were all out already munching on the grass. I always find that they're more active in the evenings. Let's open up their little... Hi guys! So a little life hack or guinea pig hack that I do is I use my old baby plates slash toddler plates, I don't know, I've got Barbie over here. Ooh. So that was my brother's old plate there. It's got some diggers and fun stuff on. As you can see, Holly is really enjoying the carrot there. Oh, she's gone for the cucumber. Holly is definitely the bravest out of all of them. You've got Scout over here that has just come along. And then the one back there is Miranda and she's actually the mother of all of them. And then Vanilla is in the little pod up at the top. So in the summertime, the guinea pigs are out all of the time. This is their little omelette run, so it means that they can go in when they want and they can go out on the grass when they want, which is really good. They do have a shed though that they go in at night in the winter when it's cold or rainy or the weather's just really horrible. But it seems that they're more interested in the grass than the actual carrots. The cutest thing is when they have a really long piece of grass or a really long piece of carrot and they like munch it up like there, <laughs> look at Scout. It literally looks like they're eating spaghetti, it's just so adorable. Okay, bye piggies, I'll see you later. Hi boys. You having a nice little time in the shade? Oh Casper, your ears fall about. Should I fix your ear out Casp? Hey boy. Shall I um... There we go, let's poke that back through, shall we? So we actually have a hay delivery now. I literally just got back from a driving lesson and my dad texted me that we do. So I don't know when the guy is gonna get here with the hay, but I need to move everything out the way and move some of the junk that's here so we can put the hay bales in. But first, we need to get you boys out the way. So now the boys are in their stables. I literally gave them the teeniest handful of chaff in their bucket. Now I need to open the gate. So now that's open, we need to get the cord out. So that's out of the way. I've now parked the quad over there so it's all out of the way. Had to do a little three point turn around here, that was interesting. But anyway, now in here, there is a lot of room to get the hay in. Okay, so the hay area is now all clear from all the mess. As you can see, the hay at the bottom is quite horrible and dusty. All of the nice bits I'm gonna put in a hay net and give it to the donkeys. But the rest I am going to throw away just because it's so dusty and Mickey and Casper can't have it because Mickey has his respiratory problem and I don't want to make that worse. Also some is a little bit damp and just disgusting so we'll see how much we can keep. Mickey really wants to eat the hay. <laughs> so now this area is cleared, I'm gonna give it a little sweep because you can see how much horrible dust and there's a bit of damp there and everything as well. So the reason we don't really have any hay this time of year is because the horses are out 24 seven, so they're in the field, they have grass. We kind of need some hay, so we've got hay delivery coming now. Just to show you that you're one. enjoy the vlog and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!